Hi guys, I'm out here in Florida on vacation. Uh, my cousin's getting married tomorrow. So Eric and I came down and so did my whole family. And we've been catching fish left and right. Um, we're using spinning rods and shrimp for now. It's a little windy for my new Winston rod. Low tide, it's pretty shallow, so we're not using any weight. We also have chum in the water. We've been doing well. Eric just caught a flipper fish and I caught one earlier. Those things are pretty dark. It's been a lot. It's been super fun. I'm just trying to fish. As you can see with my shirt. <laughs> Look, Tommy. Look, Mom, show me your hat. My mom's wearing one of my hat. She's my biggest fan. <laughs> Eric's hooked up. Look at that. Oh, that's a heater. What the heck is that? That's what you eat right there. Is it? Uh, <laughs> it's a snapper or something. It's round. We need to work on our edge or our ocean fish knowledge. What? Yeah, that's a good one. filming that video a little late but uh, I'm still gonna fish at our next spot everyone wants to go swim so we're gonna do that and I'm still gonna cast some lines this is a spot I grew up fishing right here you've never been here <laughs> you've never been here this is one of my favorite spots we used to catch a lot of these little baby hammerheads here when I was a kid super fun stuff a little bit bigger. We have a lot of bait, ballyhoo, shrimp, squid, so we're gonna see what we can catch. <laughs> On a crab. I got my crab next to me. What will it be? What will it be? Bonahead, you got yes. one. What? You got a bonahead. Should I get a bone, get a picture with it? Yeah, we gotta get him on. He's a good one. Oh, cool. Check that out. Hey, ready? You want me to flip him on? Yeah. Come on, grab a leader. Yep. Nice. Hooked right in the corner, huh? Yay! Awesome, Bridget. That's cool. Yeah, too. You got the pliers? Pliers? Yep. Right here. There you go. Cool. Yay! That's awesome. On a crab. Yeah, on a crab. That, yeah, get a good pick of this. Yeah. On a crab that the girls caught on the chum bag. Yeah, good job, girls. <laughs> can, I, can I touch them? Catch, babe. Thanks. Paid off. I knew I wasn't gonna get 
as many hits using the crab, but I knew when something ate it, it would be something big. Yep. So. You're patient. You got the patience, that's for sure. That was fun. Guys, huh? Yeah, so fun. So that was super fun. I got two of those bonnet heads, which that's what I literally grew up catching. We, I caught one on a crab, one on a belly. We're getting out of here now. Hurricane Irma, you got the green trees, and you got the shredded trees, mangroves. boat loaded up now uh, onto the trailer. That was a super fun day. So I didn't get a lot of footage in the beginning because it was some really rough seas and we weren't catching a lot of fish. Uh, Dylan did catch like a, a parrot fish or something like that. There's a wave runner going by. Um, and then after that Eric and I caught a bunch of snapper. I have a couple clips of that. And then I caught those two uh, bonnet heads which is super fun. Like I said I grew up catching those. So that that gives me good memories because uh, they're pretty much what got me into fishing. But that was a super fun day. I do have to say in the beginning of the day I was wearing something to totally different and I got so soaked because the way it was probably like five foot seas, no joke. It's probably like three to five I would say but more towards five when we got to our destination. But I got so soaked. It's one of those days where you need a pack like this. I brought my Rocket Gator camo pack out here that's 100% waterproof. Remember you can use Bridget 20 for uh, 20% off at rockagator.com. I actually have five 50% off codes that I'm going to be giving on my Instagram. So stay tuned for that. But yeah, it was one of those days where you literally need a waterproof pack because it protected all my fishing stuff, all my camera gear, my phone, everything. And I, like I said, I was sitting um, just on a seat in the boat. So was Eric and we both got soaking wet. We couldn't even see out of our sunglasses. So I'm super thankful I have a Rockagator pack. I don't know how I lived without one before this year. Well, we're all done fishing. We just ate some snapper. Eric cooked it up. It was super good. Look how red I am. I literally matched my shirt. This is bad. I even put on sunscreen and I tried to cover up, but I had no idea my face was getting this burnt. I got super blonde too. That happens really fast. Oh my gosh. Um, we're on our way to eat dinner with my family because it's my birthday sometime next week. So we're going to have a birthday dinner right now at Lazy Lobster. Um, in Key Largo, which is owned by the previous owners of Lazy Days in Isla Mirada, which is my favorite restaurant ever. So I'm excited to get some fish, super Lazy Days style with jalapeno and Parmesan cheese. It's gonna be so good. We're hungry, right, Eric? I'm hungry. We're hungry. That snapper tasted good, and all it did was make my appetite go up. I want more fish now. Yeah, that was like a little appetizer. But thanks so much for watching, guys. Uh, that was probably, we haven't had a lot of days to fish down here. This is a super short trip for my cousin's wedding, but that was a super good day. So I'm glad we were able to catch some fish. Those little uh, bonnet heads were so fun. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. See ya.